What's up, YouTube? As y'all know, Squid Girl is one of my favorite tokens to follow, right? But the thing is, there's barely any news coming out on it. Barely anything. They don't give me nothing. They don't give me nothing. I don't, I don't think they give us. They just don't put out anything. So, it leaves time for me to do some extra diving. And do some speculating, right? And just theorize everything with Squid Girl. Right now, Squid Girl's price, according to Coin Market Cat, is at seven zeros one zero one three. And if you follow what is going on on Pool Coin, it's relatively the same at the time of recording this video. With the trading volume being at three point five million dollars and the market cap being at three point five million dollars as well, so. Things are looking solid, and by the way, yes, I know that the trading volume or partially the trading volume is artificial, but keep in mind, if you didn't know, here's some extra knowledge for you guys to know that you may not have been aware of in the past or previously before watching this video. 50% is speculated of Bitcoin's trading volume to be fake. If not 50%, then 40%. And then during 2019, 95% of this trading volume was fake. That's that's just just throw that out there. But also that has to deal with some un irregulated, uh, unregulated uh, platforms that the trading was being done on. So that's that's just put that out there. All right, just for those who did not know. All right. Now let's get to the trading volume bet break breakdown. I don't know why I'm saying break 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 down, but you got one million coming from Bitmart, three hundred sixty thousand coming from Bitchu, five hundred thousand coming from MEXC, and six two hundred sixty coming from Gate.io. With oh yeah, five hundred thousand coming from BKEX. Now scripted, I I can see this data, and you've covered this stuff. What's new? Did you know that on all 11 platforms, those 11 platforms have averaged 11.5 million weekly visits throughout uh, this this bear market. For the last week, they've at, they've had 11.5 million weekly visits, right? In a bear market, that mind. Did you also know that Gate.io, not Gate.io, DigiFinex? is third is third ranking in weekly visits with 2.6 million dollars uh not million dollars 2.6 million weekly visits did you know that gate.io is ranked 10th with 1.9 million weekly visits and then when you look at mexc l bank and as well as bitmart it is also in the top 20 when it comes to exchange weekly visits. And if you don't believe me, then we can come and look at Coin Market Cap and see that Gate.io is ranked higher. It also is L Bank, also is Bitchu, also is MEXC, also is DigiFinex. Rick ranked higher in weekly visits than Coinbase. Those are some stats. It's the favorite my favorite line in uh and coach and coach Carter, those are some stats for y'all. So, what am I telling? What are you going to do with this data? What can you do with this data? I should also keep tell you that Bitconomy Exchange is the one that offers the lowest. Them and Decoin offer the lowest uh, weekly visits, with them both bringing in thirteen thousand to fourteen thousand weekly visits, at least for the last week. So, but what can you do with this? Because right now it's a bear market. People aren't really looking for that top token, right? There's where we segue into this next portion of the video. And thank God. Thank God for that. But let's talk about Binance. Yes, yes, I know. I said Binance, the big guy. The one that's number one in weekly visits. Number one on coin market cap. Number one in almost every category. Especially the categories that mean something to people. The volume, the weekly visits, the exchange score, the average liquidity. Number one in everything. That is Binance. I don't think that 
Squid Grow should list with Binax soon. Soon. And soon means within this year. Now, Ship Toshi can do whatever the heck he wants. And I will trust his decision. I'm the investor. He's the guy that's controlling the token. He's done a great job controlling the token thus far. Which led to me investing into Squid Grow. So I will trust him if he that he has a plan for why he's doing it early. But I would love a scenario where Binance. This is... I, this is a hey, this is storyline. I would love a scenario where it's a bull market. It's 2024. Bitcoin's at 69,000. Scratch that. Bit, it's 2024. Bitcoin has overcame its high, its all time high, and it's at 90,000. Staying, staying relatively where the same. Where is that currently? And now people are like, okay, staying the same. Where are some other tokens I can get in? Squid Grow is listing on Binance in the next 14 days. Squid Grow is about to be listed on Binance. Squid Grow, Squid Grow, Squid Grow, Squid Grow is all over. And then we have, imagine we are at 11.5 million weekly visits right now I was trying to figure out what pancake swap is uh, weekly visits are and I left that out of the statistics because the most recent data I could find that in the highest of the highs basically when Bitcoin's at 16 point was as was at 69k and safe moon was going crazy or ever really during this time ever coin was going crazy it was November 19th of 2021 Pancake Swap had 18 million visits. Now they're not at 18 million weekly visits, but in one week they had 18 million visits. And if we go back to the top exchanges, Binance currently has 17 million ex visit, weekly visits. Imagine, imagine what it would be during the all-time high of Bitcoin. And imagine what all the other ones, what Digifinex, what Big One, what L Bank, MEXE, how many weekly visits they'll have. And then they hear Squid Grow's about to be on Binance. Just like Shiba. When it was rumored Shiba was about to be listed on Binance. When everybody else was about to get listed on Binance. Who's the next token that's going to be listed on Binance? Who's going to get listed? Squid Girl. We're on Bitmark. We're on Big One. We're on LBank. We're on Gate.io. We're on PancakeSwap. Big Economy. So many platforms. So it's going to be easy for people to buy into Squid Girl. For one and two, once it's listed on Binance, that's going to be available for people over 17 million people at least, or it's going to be viewed over 17 million times because it's going to have 17 million weekly visits during that time period. Over oh, that many. That's when I would love to see Binance on or Squid Grow listing on Binance now. If it listed before, is it bad? No, it just sets us up for that bull run. But I would love to see that hype. And it would go with it being a meme coin. It would go with it. And it's the Squid Game token. It's Squid Grow token, but it's the, it's obviously taken from Squid Game. That's how the public will look at it. It's going to make me rich. It's the next Shiba. The next Saitama. The next Doge. But let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Do you guys agree? Do you feel like what I've... Or do you go, feel like what I've said has some merit? Or do you just completely disagree with me? And by the way, you saying that my theory having some merit doesn't mean you fully agree with me. It just means you see my point. Let me see. Let me hear what you guys say in the comment section above. Script Legend signing out. God loves you. I love you. Peace.